Hello, fabulous Aquarius. Welcome to your monthly horoscope for the month of February 2012. I am your astrologer, Nadia Shaw. Thank you so much for being here. Well, bigger than anything else that is happening in the sky for you this month is that Neptune leaves your sign early this month. Early in February, Neptune finally leaves your sign. Neptune's been hanging out in Aquarius since the 90s. You may not even remember what life was like before Neptune entered your sign. But what's been really great about Neptune in your sign has been an awakening of a spiritual understanding and an understanding of a personal connection that you have to a higher power, however you choose to define that higher power of the divine. And this is great, or it has been at times great, when it has helped you feel more connected to others and has helped you feel a connection to a beautiful mystical energy. But it's not so great when it leaves you feeling a little bit confused or unsure about what it is that you are supposed to do about yourself, and especially around questions of the things that you were so sure of, that you were always meant to do, all of a sudden seem to wash away and you just have to accept that maybe a higher hand might want something else for your life. And that's not always easy, that delicate balance between honoring our free will and surrendering the results when we exercise it. So now Neptune is leaving and this is really very exciting for you because your strength is your rationality. Your strength is your ability to look at all aspects of life with a certain wise detachment, a detachment of emotions that allows you to see things from a balanced perspective. And that part of you, that best part of you is going to return. And usually when Neptune leaves a sign, it takes us a while to realize that, okay, Neptune's gone now, thank you. But for you, I'm actually seeing that the awareness comes on rather quickly. Very soon after Neptune leaves your sign, you realize that something has changed, that you are no longer under the sway of another energy and that you can now decide to deal with things much more intellectually calling on different gifts that you have within you. While Neptune was in your sign, yes, you connected to a mystical energy, and that's really lovely. Those lessons will always be with you. You now have that connection, and that can stay with you. But what's really great is that your intellect starts to strengthen. Your rationality starts to strengthen. You start to feel more like yourself, and with that comes a greater sense of self-possession. But most importantly, comes a greater sense of clarity of what it is that you're meant to do right now and how it is that you can move your life forward. And with that clarity, you take some decisive steps without any fear, without any confusion, but instead with calm rationality that assures positive results. Hello fabulous friends and fans. Back in late 2011, I launched the monthly horoscope videos just like the one you're seeing now and expanded my online show, Nadia Shaw Productions. I said to you, if you liked them, to share them and also to share your feedback on Facebook, Twitter, Google Plus and of course through my website, NadiaShaw.com and boy did you ever. Thank you so much for the countless notes I've received, the words of encouragement. My YouTube channel is set to hit a million views. A million views, that's incredible. And I know that it's all thanks to you. Thank you so much. Your words, your sharing, your viewership, your readership of my horoscopes on my website, NadiaShaw.com, have meant so much to me. I've decided to continue these monthly horoscope videos into 2012 and you will soon see season two of Nadia Shaw Productions right here on YouTube and of course on my website as well. It'll be a great year and a great month, a great season and I will be here to celebrate it with you. Enjoy.